welcome, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be doing my second and last back to school video. I had a few back to school video ideas. I realized this was probably the only one in my range for back to school, but I'm just going to get into the video. I thought, you know what, if I went back to school, like if I really went back to school, I don't know what I would do. That's part of the reason I didn't stay in school in the first place. I have a job now though, but if I were to go back to school, what would I do? Who would I ask? I have three friends. One includes my ex-boyfriend, my current boyfriend, and then one other friend, Michaela. Asking my family would be a disaster. Half my family would immediately laugh and be like, you're not going back to school. And then the other half would be like, oh, we've been waiting for this moment, you know? I remember doing like maybe one or two of these when I was actually debating like what I wanted to go to college for because I was like, any advice? And I also remember like wanting it to like land on certain, not land on certain things, but wanting it to tell me certain things. I just said it like it was like my whole life is a game. Like I'm just hoping this career chooser lands on this. So I'm basically gonna look up like a few career quizzes. I just type into Google, what should I do for a living quiz? Let's do career match test free. Career quiz, the Princeton Review promising two hours later that's so stupid oh my god i went through all that and i don't want so i don't want to sign up for princeton so let's do a buzzfeed quiz so that one didn't really work because i didn't want to sign up because i'm not actually going buzzfeed what should your major actually be which of these do you hate the most <laughs> what's the longest comfortable going without a shower um which of these meals looks the most appetizing? Okay, one of the meals is literally just beer and then one is smoking, one is ramen. None of these look really appetizing to me, I guess, the sushi. How much does your current outfit cost? Um, $20-ish from Pink and 20-ish, $5 from Pink, so 45. I'm naked. <laughs> <laughs> got it all for free at the thrift store. I don't know when the, like they made this quiz, but like thrift stores are not free. I love thrift stores though, but they're definitely like some of them are more pricey than this. Like 50. But I'm also wearing like next to nothing. It's from Pink, so. Um, how many drinks have you had this week? I don't drink. Next question. Me. Who would you want as a professor? Like I don't want to say Kanye, but I think out of everyone, Kanye. <laughs> Which of these is the sexiest? I'm between the deep questions and the grand romantic gestures. Um, I picked the grand romantic gestures, but I swear I wasn't always like this, so like, I don't know what happened to me. <laughs> what is your ultimate goal in life? Honestly, I wish somebody could just tell me. I read a book the other day, it's called Tell Me Three Things. I literally finished this book in four days. I keep making like the same comment and joke in my head, like I wish someone would tell me just one thing. And this could be it. What is your ultimate goal in life? Definitely not be president. I think like the end goal for everything is make the world better in some way. Like even after I, yeah. Okay, so I chose that and I got environmental science. You care about the future generations and know that it's our responsibility to lead the world better than we found it. You're well loved because you're passionate and caring. Instead of whining about your problems, you solve them. I mean, depending on the day, yeah. Okay, no, like that part is kind of true. I'm more for like people. Like I want to make the world better in like a humanity level. Now we're doing one off play bus. What should you major in? Let's play. Business, accounting, finance. What? I mean, to be fair, when I did go for a year. Just hope you didn't pick marketing. That's what I was. Literally when I was in school, I went to school, like college for a year and a semester. My major was internet marketing. It literally says, just hope you didn't pick marketing. That is so bizarre. Apparently I picked the wrong major, which I guess they're not wrong because I didn't stay. Okay, my camera just like stopped recording for a second. This quiz has 15 questions. I feel like this angle is like not what it was. You're a connector. 
curious about the world around you and a creative boot. So 39% of the people who took this quiz are a thinker. 47% are a doer. And 8%, which is what I received, is a connector. So I'm of the 8%, and then there's one other one that's even smaller, 4%, is an innovator. This has over a million have taken this, over a million, and only 8% got the connector. I think that this one is the most accurate so far. I don't know that I love the idea of communications or economics. Couldn't be in medicine because I would get way too attached to the patient. Okay, I'm gonna take one more. Which trait do you have that is most important to have? Empathy, wisdom, open-mindedness. I'd say empathy. Which do you find the most fascinating? The human mind. You should major in theater, which is what I went to high school for. This one I would say is also accurate. On that note, because I think that one's accurate, that's where I'm gonna end this video. If I were to really be letting the internet pick my major, I would have now four completely different options. Buzzfeed, Quizzy, or something was one of them. Those were the two that I think got like my personality more right, and then the college ones were trying to base things that you would decently like off of like a college major that they offered. It was a full realm. But I think that some of them are pretty accurate. Like even the environmental science, even though that's not something that particularly interests me, the reasoning why made sense and it made sense to like what I answered to the questions. That's interesting. I guess if I ever look back into going to school, I'll look into environmental science, business and accounting, and theater. Maybe I can act as a accountant that finances for environmental science. And then I'll be doing all three of the things that, you know, the internet said I should do. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up so that I know that you like videos like these. Stay tuned for more videos and more things. I'm vlogging more now because I'm trying to get my life together and you know, it should be fun to vlog it and watch it not happen. Anyways, thank you guys again so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. I've been up all week, not getting any sleep, trying to read the signs. I don't know how much more I can take, how much longer I can wait before I...